hello. Welcome to Tape Measure Pencil Knife. Perfect. Today, on Tape Measure Pencil Knife, I'm building some wall art. Mountainous wall art. I got this beautiful wood off the walls of my cabin in the mountains, and I'm going to use it to make some wooden wall art of some mountains to hang on the wall in my cabin in the mountains. Maybe. I got this uh, little miniature sheet of plywood. It's two foot wide by, by four foot and it's half inch thick. It's cheaper just to buy a little piece. That's all I need, two foot by four foot. That's about the perfect size for a wall art. I'm gonna take this wood that I took off the walls in the cabin, and I'm going to rip it on a table saw into three quarter inch strips. Then I can use the, uh, the inside for the lighter side of the mountain and the outside for the darker side of the mountain. My, my wall art's gonna, well, you've seen it, right? You saw the thumbnail. You want to see it again? I mean, you're, we're already here. Just let's just. Yeah, yeah, that looks good. So I use the inside for the lighter side and the outside for the darker side. That's the shadows. That's a shadow, right? Something like that. I'm gonna draw some mountains on the plywood. Rip the boards, cut them in a nice mountain jagged edge. Use a jigsaw, cut the mountains out. Glue the three-quarter inch strips to the half inch piece of plywood, trim the edges when I'm finished with the mountains, and then uh, wrap it in a border, make some kind of border to go around it, some kind of frame. But, um, oh, I got some merchandise. I always said when I hit 25,000 subscribers, I would get a shirt or a hat or something for sale. Maybe I said 100,000 subscribers, but I couldn't wait any longer. You can get this down below on Teespring. This company, you just order the shirt and they make it. I don't have to do anything except design it. And you see the, you see the creative genius. Look at this. I spent months designing this. So get your tape measure pencil knife hoodies or t-shirts down below. Enough of the commercials. You trying to sell something? I didn't come here to, to buy your stupid shirt. I came here to learn how to make a mountainous wall art. Let's go. Tape measure pencil knife, mountain wall art thing. I'm really bad at this, but it's time.
Well, it's looking awesome. Looking good. I think that was the easy part though. Matching some lines, kind of. I didn't really color inside the lines. I figured, eh, close enough, close enough. Doesn't have to be exact. This part has to be exact. These light colored ones going this way. Look, and this, these are, those will have to be cut on both sides. I'm going to call it a day for today. Pick this back up tomorrow. But it's coming along nice. Nicely. It's coming along great. I'm really happy with my progress thus far. Picking this back up on another day. Maybe tomorrow. Day two. Let's just get, let's just get right back into it. Beautiful.
awesome these in between the the light parts that are in between the shadow sides of the mountain where you have to get two random angles correct with a jigsaw those aren't that easy but a lot easier than I thought it was gonna be all night last night I kept thinking oh man how many pieces am I gonna mess up trying to get those to work and the answer was three so far. Still have a long way to go. But three that just cut too short, wasn't going to fit, throw it out, start over. Actually, don't throw it out. I used it for kind of a template to get the next one closer to right on the first cut and then still had to trim it a couple times, but no big deal. It's coming right along. It's looking good. Let's go ahead and get to tomorrow and finish these mountains.
This one was the hardest one yet. Mountains are finished and they look awesome. I kind of regret when I first drew it some of those sharp points and zigzags. I mean I always knew I was going to be cutting out all of those zigzags but if I could go back I might make it a little less zigzaggy some of those points maybe a little less sharp. Although the way it looks, it turned out really awesome. So maybe I shouldn't go back and make the points duller. All that's left is the sky. And some people think I should just paint the top part black or blue. Make it like a daytime sky. Let it just be plywood. Then the mountains have depth but some people want horizontal three-quarter by three-quarter boards cut to all those mountains. All right, that's enough for today. Man, this thing's really drawing out. This project's really taking a lot longer than I thought it was going to, but maybe next time we finish it, and maybe we don't. Hard to say. It's hard to say.
honestly, it turned out even better than I thought. And it's finished, but it's not quite finished. We still have to make a frame. I'm going to rip the edges straight on a table saw because I didn't even try to keep the things perfectly straight throughout the project. I just figured it would be easier to rip it on a table saw at the end. Cut the short edges on a miter saw. And then wrap it in a frame. And then do a little sanding because I have some hot glue strings that are in the cracks and in the wood grains that I would like to sand out. But make sure not to sand off the dark parts of the mountains because it wouldn't take much and then you'll be down into the the light grain of the wood. Okay, this has gone on way too long. I'm still going. Let's let's finish this thing. It's time. Officially finished. I still have to add these to the back to hang it. Just the little D ring hangers. I'll put them on later. I want to hang it up on a wall to see what it looks like as a wall art. As some of you may know, the cabin is not ready for wall art. It it literally just lost its walls. It doesn't even have walls for art to hang on. But, I'm gonna hang it up somewhere, temporarily, and try to get a good visual of what I have created, which is beautiful mountainous wall art. Turned out really, really good. It's not that hard. It was just really time consuming. And if you stayed this long, one, you were either bored, you didn't have anything better to watch. Two, you really just wanted to see the finished product. Which means you probably just fast forwarded to here. Hey, go back and finish every minute of it. All 30 something. Alright. That's it. Stay tuned for the, the wall reveal. I'll play some music and get some good shots of it hanging on a wall right after I touch that lens for the last time. From all of us here, I tape measure pencil knife. It's just me, just one. Thank you for watching all 
however many minutes of this. And I'll see you next time where we might build something different. Definitely won't be building the same thing. Don't forget, buy the hoodies down below. This, not this hoodie, the hoodie from the beginning, down below. Just get one, get one for your spouse and tell them, hey, you, you might not know what tape measure pencil knife is, but now you have a hoodie that says it. Okay, see you next time.